everyone, uh, back again, me and Jim, uh, today we're going for a medium range sauce and I thought I would do Crazy Ed's Cave Creek Chili Beer Brand Hot Sauce, uh, another one from the Hot Sauce Emporium, I've been told this one's pretty damn tasty uh, and it is 100% natural as it says, uh, for ingredients we have fresh carrots, selected red peppers, I'm not sure what red peppers they are, probably everything from your red jalapenos to, I don't know, maybe habanero, but we'll see, I'm not sure. Uh, fresh onions, key lime juice, garlic and salt, so 100% natural, no preservatives, no xanthan gums, no acetic acids, no, it's just kind of pretty damn fresh, which I like. There's not many sauces, but I wonder... I like a sauce where it'd be about 90% chili pulp, but we'll see. we'll see. So security seals are irritating at the best of times. And today is again one of those times. <laughs> right. There we go. There. Yeah. So top's different on this one, it's got a pop lid instead of a screw on and off lid. So a decent sized hole as well. But as I'm doing table we're doing tablespoons, might as well just take it off and screws quite nicely too. So consistency and colour, colour is very carroty. I don't see many red. There you go. It's very carroty and lots of chunks in there, but very orange chunks. So, that smells good. It smells very chilly, actually. <laughs> <laughs> it smells sweet. Very sweet. Mm. Right, so, when you're ready, mate. Mm. I'm liking that. It's very tasty, it's very garlicky. Well, not very garlicky, but it's just enough. But the heat, it's definitely a selection of nice red hot peppers. I can't pick out any definitive peppers, kind of taste wise. Habanero, I can pick out. Definitely the habanero. Yes, definitely, definitely that banana. Jalapeno, so habanero, jalapeno, uh, so yeah, overall, fantastic, you've got Crazy Ed's K Creek Chili Beer brand hot sauce. So what do you think of it, man? All right. That heat straight away. It seems you have straight away, straight mm. to the lips and the tongue. Mm. But it doesn't get past a level that's unbearable. It's hits at almost its peak heat wise instantly, but it carries itself really well. It's still just as hot now. Actually, my throat's calmed down a little bit. It was almost instantly on the back of the throat as well. Lips. Mm. Very lippy. Very lippy. <laughs> I'm gonna have an, I'm gonna have another spoonful. Do you want one? No. I'm not gonna have a heap tablespoonful, but that was really nice. See if I can pick out any more flavours for you guys. I do like the way that heat punches you though, as you can see I'm now starting to sweat a bit, it's quite warm here at the moment, anyway, but it's making me sweat, yeah definitely, <laughs> but it's nice, I really recommend this one, if you're 
not a fan of any sauces with the extracts and you want something to use with everything that if you like it hot this has onions, garlic, salt, chilies, key lime juice which all bring it to a really nice nice flavour it's not it, yeah it hasn't got that vinegar kind of hit to it either which I'm not a fan of so heat wise actually I'd give that I'd give that a, a healthy 6 out of 10. What do you reckon? Yeah. I was predicting 4, but it's gone up. It's about 6. 5 or 6, yeah. Mm. And for taste, you can't get much better. I'd give that a, a 9.5. Can't quite give that a 10. Not for me anyway, but a good 9.5. I like the taste of that. It's not too garlicky. It's not too salty. Onions, you've got the texture of kind of mashed up, and the carrots, you've got the texture they're mashed up. It gives it that pulpiness. It's quite nice. But definitely, and it says authentic Mexican hot sauce. And we have from the same crazy guys that brought you Cave Creek Chili Beer and Hot and Hard Lemonade. <laughs> Undoubtedly, the best hot sauce you've ever tasted. Crazy Ed and the gang searched Mexico and came up with a 100% natural hot sauce with no vinegar and no preservatives. This sauce gives you the flavour you need without searing the heat of vinegar based sauces. Yeah, definitely. And it's, it's one of those you can use with pizza, wings, curries, stir fries, uh, steaks, marinades, everything. You know, good all rounder. Yeah, it's one I'll be putting in the fridge and I'll be labelling Leo's only. Don't touch. Because <laughs> it's a nice heat. First, it hits the throat, and then it's kind of the tongue, it sizzles the top. And like most sauces, it moves its way to the front of the mouth. The mouth. You didn't really notice it on the throat, it's just the lips. Mm. The edge of my lips now are really starting to burn. Nicely, though. Hot and sweaty, but. Awesome. Right. Mm. www.hotsauceemporium.co.uk Don't forget to go and check them out and uh, see for yourselves. Definitely worth getting that one for the shelf. Looks cool. Tastes amazing. Heat's pretty medium, but it's, yeah, it's spot on. So, cool. It's bye from me. Bye from me. And catch you next time. Hopefully something hotter. And... Before I go, I must say we've got uh, the bomb fine lancer in the post coming to me, so hopefully that'll be arriving tomorrow. Whether we'll do it tomorrow or not is a different answer, I don't think we will. So we'll have that for you ready for the weekend. So look forward to that one. So I'll stop you there. Catch you.